Zoe, is that so fun? So the harness, the harness that I got, um, I, I originally had put this strap to attach down here, but because my daughter is still on the smaller side, she needed to be a little more secure. So um, I ended up sticking it back under the seat and attaching it right here so it's still not in the way of opening this um and then the same with the straps on the top that go over her arms they just attach here um if you have a bigger kid or if you don't want it to slide you can put it on this side of it so that um so that the screw makes it not be so um, loose right there. Um, but for my daughter, I need it to be able to move it. Um, and then each of those arm ones is attached at the same spot. Um, this is, honestly, it, this one is so that it doesn't move. Um, and then this one, is on this side and it just really helps because she's still um, her oh, she's still floppy enough that she needs to have a, a bigger harness um, and then I also put the the regular seatbelt that you guys have on it um, put that over her lap as well the stretchy cargo net, um, it works great. Um, I just ordered it separately and put it on in a couple different places. Um, I hooked some of it on with the pieces that it came with and others I used um, the zip ties. Uh, for me, the reason I did that is because my daughter likes to try to put her feet on the tires because of sensory things <laughs> um, and then this little basket I also had to attach because again sensory things she tries to reach for the tire 